record heat, raging wildfires. Let's talk more about the why. Bill Weir is CNN's chief climate correspondent. Bill, more than two dozen scientists at World Weather Attribution mince no words in blaming humans for last month's deadly heat wave in the Northwest. It was virtually impossible without man-made climate change, they say. How important is that statement? I think it's hugely important, Anna. I mean, scientists, as a, as a breed, basically, do not want to be considered alarmists. They're very conservative in how they attribute specific events, particularly in meteorology, and linking them directly. But as the evidence rolls in, it just becomes undeniable. These numbers are so far off the charts in a part of the world that is so unused to this kind of uh, weather activity that they have to say this is a once in a thousand year event. And of course, it's the result of, of humanity pumping sort of planet cooking pollution into the sky and the ocean for now over a century, well over a century. And this is exactly what sort of the worst predictions were. Even five, 10 years ago, this would have been considered alarmist to see what's happening in the Pacific Northwest, but, but here we are. I mean, it does seem like this is happening so much sooner than any of us had anticipated. And we, we know in California, for example, they just recorded its driest rainfall year on record, more than 125 years of record keeping. Uh, and that's on top of an existing drought. Where could this be headed? Oh, it's, it's nowhere good, unfortunately, if you think